Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting during two episode 79 of My Hero Academia. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> Well, I mean, of course, the training is going to be a little harder because... <laughs> something I really want to say, but I want to wait until the end of the episode today, or probably the weekend there to say it, because this is something that's like, <laughs> this has been on my mind ever for like the longest time, and I think a lot of people will probably feel this way towards <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh god. All right. <laughs> But hold on, you're with Endeavor, so no matter what. I still love him, even though he's an asshole, but... Mm. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, because he got the commotion. He's an embarrassing parent. <laughs>
Any hell of with that either, though. You just gotta be more cautious next time. Because you never know what could happen. I mean, I give Bakugo Totoro Todoroki what to say say Kami, but like for the rest of them, like, oh, I don't fail. Those four against me, y'all. No. <laughs> Wrong answer. <laughs> yeah, you don't have compassion. <laughs> I yeah. <laughs> oh, fucking kids. <laughs> Little demon. <laughs> I don't know. This is kind of why I probably couldn't work at a daycare, but I mean, I can tolerate kids. Kids ask a lot of questions, so. <laughs> oh. Uh huh. You gotta be the little shit of the group, aren't you? Don't be, it's okay, they're kids, they're supposed to act like that. It's worse when a kid drops your phone, and they're like, oh my god, mom, dad, such and such, your phone's cracked, you like, huh? Oh. Good luck, baby, such so a
Jesus. <laughs> Fucking kid. I don't know why he can give you his definition, but you have to find that on your own. <laughs> yeah, and now they're playing our own <laughs> with it. Oh my god. True, it is. Yeah, the one with the little shit. <laughs> oh, I've missed you so much back ago. <laughs> be fine. <laughs> we can't use right though. Yeah, because he seems like a kid at heart himself, so I think he could be able to get it. Is right about that, though. 
<laughs> violence isn't always necessary in the box world because if you use violence, they're still not going to want to work with you. <laughs> you need to be kind and gentle to these kids. See, what I'm kind of hoping what they do later on with Endeavor, like, to me, I feel like Endeavor has, like, such a very deep, deep backstory on him. And there's so many things that I feel like they haven't gone in depth in him, in my opinion. And so what I'm hoping is that later on in this show, or in the manga, whatever happens first, preferably the manga, of course, they do a little bit more on him. Like, how he was raised and how his father was. Him. Because I feel like the way he treats Shoto now, especially when he was a kid, is kind of the same way his father or his mother treated him when he was a kid. You know how something, which, whatever your parents, however your parents teach you is how you teach your kids in a way. So if your parent was possibly abusive to you, you might be abusive to your child. It's just, he's not all right, of course. Yeah, of course. Because he'll always come second to all night, no matter what. Even if he's, like, no, because I can't talk about that yet. Mm -hmm. Of course. What his definition of a symbol is, is completely different to yours. The embarrassing parent. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> At least you tried. You still have potential, man. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Sure, you were back ago. <laughs> These little fucking shits.
<laughs> Remember, guys, you can't hit the kids. Don't hit the kids. Jesus Christ. Of course. Oh, whatever's gonna happen next week. We gotta wait till next week, which freaking sucks, but it's gonna be so good. But honestly, this... <laughs> as someone who... I do love kids. I really do. At the end of the day, kids are freaking adorable. Yes, sometimes they can be bullshit and sometimes piss you the hell off, but you know, you gotta tolerate them. But I remember like at first when I read this, I was like, there is no way in hell I could possibly work for a daycare or anything because kids, you have, like, when you're around kids, you have a limit until you are, like, extremely annoyed. And yes, kids ask a lot of questions because they're kids and they want to know certain things. It's the same thing when a kid accidentally, like I said, drops your phone and then your phone is cracked and then you're sitting here wondering, hold on, wait, 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 wait. My phone wasn't cracked a minute ago. What you do, child? But, I mean, they're... They're adorable little things, and you have to love them. They're precious and just sweet. It's just, you gotta be kind and gentle sometimes. Sometimes, yeah, you can be, you know, <laughs> a little mean to them, a little bit of accent and stuff, because sometimes they just really want attention. If they're not getting it from their family members, maybe even friends, or even their teacher, they're just gonna lash out for no reason. And I get that because we were once ourselves kids and we did the exact same thing. And then, you know, there were some people always talking about us saying that we were sexy shit and stuff and that we weren't important and stuff like that. But like, even saying that to a kid, you were like, mm, stuff. they got this. Honestly, yes. It's like, don't even try to beat the kids. You can't, don't lay your hand on the kids. It's wrong. <laughs> <gasps> no, oh my god! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh my god! We're already to that part. Are you fucking kidding me? I think this is. I think this night. No, I think it's a couple of app chapters later is where I kind of like stopped or paused on my reading because I've been so busy. But oh, we're getting close. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker, I can't stop swingling. Oh my god, bro, I'm not ready for this. It's gonna fucking hurt. <laughs> but it's hilarious at the same time. But yes, please. <laughs> yes, we gotta fight the kids. But the number one thing is, like, especially, you know, when you're babysitting someone else's kids and your parents are like, yeah, you know, you can't hit the kid, right? Like, you can't beat them. And I'm like, no, I, like, we're not gonna do that. We, like, I wouldn't do that. Like, mm mm. You just sit and talk to them and stuff. And then if they still get in trouble, you go ahead and call their parents off like a speed dial. And then you tell your, tell the parents what the kid did. And then, you know, the parents will take care of it when they go. <laughs> but yes, I mean, ultimately, I remember, like, as I said at the beginning of this, I was like, I, would I ever really want to work in daycare? I would be fine still today to work in daycare. Because like I said, I can tolerate kids. Kids are sometimes a little too much but it's just it's okay that's the, one of the many things of qualities of why you love kids sometimes they like you never know one minute they can get on your nerves and the next minute they are the most adorable thing on the planet besides a freaking animal but yeah it was a damn good episode i loved it to see everything animated my girl cammy like finally here as herself not toga and shit like uh my baby i miss her so much i just love the fact is like no one can understand her <laughs> and the way she speaks she's just so adorable and precious i just hope that we get to see more of her later on and like i said the stuff i said on endeavor i hope that they end up doing something on him because Ever since I started watching this show in, like, 2016 when I was doing reactions on it before my first channel got deleted and everything, um, and especially going into season two and seeing 
Todoroki's backstory on his father and everything and why he despises his father even till today. It just still makes me wonder, like, how his father was raised. Because sometimes it, it usually is like that. I mean, think about it, really. If you have seen something from TV shows or movies where a kid has had, like, a very abusive relationship with their parents, and sometimes, usually 50 out of 50, depending on whoever they are with their significant significant other, whether it's a guy or a girl, 50 out of 50, they end up lashing out on that person or possibly their kids and they start becoming the person that they hated, which are their parents. And that's why, I mean, it's just sad and it still happens even till today. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 79 of My Hero Academia. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 80. Bye, guys.